Abigail Hagee with your NBC 26 update. We're just a few days away from thousands of more Wisconsinites being able to get a COVID vaccine. On Monday, everyone 16 and older can get one. Wisconsin currently leads the nation in the percentage of allotted vaccines into arms. More than 1 million people have completed their vaccine series. Governor Evers says that's enough to fill Lambeau Field 12 times over. In some positive news, a local man hospitalized with COVID for over 45 days was released last week from the hospital in Oshkosh. The family says life won't be the same, but nothing beats being alive together again. You can watch his full story on our website, NBC26.com. And we'll leave you with something cute to smile about today. A baby fox from a rehab near Appleton has made its way to the Chippewa Valley Wild Hype Rehabilitation Center. They shared pictures of the newborn on Facebook and say the little guy is just around four weeks old. Has a lot of growing left to do, adding he's a chock full of personality and spunk. And as you head out the door this morning, temperatures below freezing, a little bit of sunshine to start our day, but those clouds increasing as we head through the afternoon. And yeah, look at that. A few scattered flurries are possible today. No accumulations whatsoever. Winds staying strong. They're really not easing up on us at all. Gusting up to about 20 to 30 miles per hour out of the north, pulling in that cold air. So we're not going to be very warm today into those mid to upper 30s as our high temperatures. And then tonight falling back below freezing into the upper teens to low 20s. 20s under partly cloudy skies and then as we push through tomorrow only a few degrees warmer but a lot more sunshine out there as you rise into the upper 30s to low 40s this is perfect weather though to tap some maple trees and it's going to stay nice as we go into thursday but then by the weekend we are looking at those temperatures increasing as we have a nice heat wave headed our way get excited